Might Proxima b at some point be another Earth-like planet? Theory on this has everybody interested. The quest for an option-tenable planet and outsider life is something people have for quite some time been intrigued with. There have been signals recognized from Proxima b, persuading numerous to think there's something else entirely to it. Yet, notwithstanding these signs, we've yet to decide whether they're genuine messages from the planet or simply reverberates of our own signs. These signals frequently become our own echoes. In any case, researchers desire to see whether Proxima b genuinely has outsider life. On Proxima b, the James Webb Space Telescope recently observed what appeared to be artificial lights. Assuming that you're keen on finding out about different planets and our advancement in tracking down substitute life, buy into our channel. We make content about space and investigate logical developments. Leave a comment below and share the video with your friends if you enjoyed it. Back to our subject now. A faint dwarf star with the designation G0V can be found about 4.2 light years from our solar system in Proxima Centauri. It's likewise the nearest star to our Sun, making it a vital concentration for cosmologists. The framework, called Alpha Centauri, was named by Johann Bayer in 1603 and is situated close to the renowned star grouping Centaurus. Proxima Centauri is at the focal point of this framework, alongside two weak small stars known as Alpha Centauri N and B, excessively faint to be seen with the unaided eye. While Proxima B is a rough planet, researchers are confident it could hold onto extraterrestrial life. Its Earth-like size and the separation from its star make it a contender for possibly supporting life. Be that as it may, this multitude of presumptions are as yet theoretical, and there's much we want to find out about Proxima B's circle and climate. The striking similarity between Proxima B and Earth is what most piques people's interest. It's an exoplanet that circles a M-type star and is 1.27 times the mass of Earth. Proxima B requires simply 11.5 days to circle its star, which was found in 2016. Even though it looks a lot like Earth, there are some things about it that make it unlikely that it could support life. One of these is that it is close to its star so it gets a lot more ultraviolet light than we do. This radiation strips away particles, making the climate unsteady. Proxima B may be habitable, according to some, because it is so far from its star as Earth is from the Sun. However, the absence of water or a protective atmosphere, two essential components for maintaining life, cannot be explained by distance alone. The climate on Earth safeguards living organic entities from risky space climate. Thus far, there's no proof of such an error on Proxima B. In the event that you're partaking in the substance, pause for a minute to buy into the channel. We're focused on making more space and science-related content like this. Presently, for what reason in all actuality do certain individuals suppose the James Webb Space Telescope will assist us with sorting out whether or not there's life on Proxima b? Sent off in 2018 after a progression of postponements, this strong telescope was intended to notice infrared light. It can catch photographs of far-off planets and distinguish designs that propose the presence of water or a climate. Scientists can also detect artificial illumination, and possibly even evidence of a civilization on Proxima b, by observing infrared light. One benefit space telescopes have over ground-based ones is that they don't need to look through the world's environment, and that implies they get a more clear perspective on far-off objects. The disadvantage? Repairing space telescopes is very expensive. In the case of something turns out badly, there's no fast method for fixing them. The James Webb Telescope is situated over 1.5 million kilometers away, excessively far for any salvage mission. Be that as it may, its huge mirror permits it to see back to the start of the universe, around 13.7 a long time back, giving us phenomenal understanding into the universe. This makes noticing Proxima b and other far-off planets a lot more straightforward. Tabor and Loeb have proposed a scale to recognize counterfeit light on planets. Assuming Proxima b's night side is enlightened by even 5% of its star's regular light, the telescope could identify it with 85% exactness. At 9% brightening, that discovery leaps to 95%. Proxima b, on the other hand, is so close to its star that it may be tidally locked, with one side always facing the star and the other always dark. Notwithstanding this multitude of hypotheses, we don't have verification yet. 
the James Webb Telescope has demonstrated the way that Earth itself should be visible sparkling from space because of a peculiarity called airglow, driven by sun-powered radiation. Could something almost identical be going on Proxima b? Albeit the James Webb Telescope has given us unbelievable outcomes, it's simply the start. The Habitable Exoplanet Observatory, HabEx, which is expected to be completed by 2035, will further revolutionize space research. HabEx will have the innovation to gauge the spectra of far-off planets, assisting researchers with deciding whether they're livable. It will likewise assist with concentrating on the earliest snapshots of the universe's set of experiences and the components that help life as far as we might be concerned. Notwithstanding HabEx, the huge UV optical infrared assessor Louvoir is being created and vows to improve how we might interpret space enormously. At the point when these telescopes send off, we'll have much more clear perspectives on Proxima b and other possibly tenable planets. In spite of the fact that we've gained critical headway, there's still such a lot of we want to find out about Proxima b. With better innovation, we could at long last response the inquiry. Is there life out there? Might Proxima b at some point be another Earth-like planet? These are theories everybody continues to make. The quest for an option-tenable planet and outsider life on different planets is something that people are captivated with. There have been different hypotheses, and the way that signs have been distinguished coming from Proxima b causes individuals to accept there is another side to it. Notwithstanding this large number of signs, we presently can't seem to decide whether these are messages from the planet or simply reverberates of our own researchers' signs. Frequently, these signs end up as reverberations. Scientists hope to determine if extraterrestrial life exists by determining whether these signals truly originate from Proxima b. On Proxima b, artificial lights were recently detected by the James Webb Telescope. Assuming that you're keen on finding out about different planets and our advancement in tracking down substitute life, buy into our channel. We make content about space and examine developments in science. In the event that you like this substance, remark underneath and share this video with your companions. Presently, we should return into our video. Proxima Centauri, around 4.2 light a long time from our nearby planet group, is a weak small star named G0V. As a result, the star is called Proxima Centauri. This star is the nearest to our sun and nearby planet group. It was named Alpha Centauri in horology by Johann Bayer in 1603. The name came from the star's climb around early afternoon, while a few divine bodies like the moon and the sun were in an orderly fashion. Proxima Centauri is otherwise called Alpha Centauri or Alpha CN. There are four main stars in a straight line in this one star system. The framework's Proxima Centauri is at the middle. Aside from the four stars, there are two weak midgets. Alpha Centauri A, likewise called Rigel Centaurus, and Alpha Centauri B. These make up the majority of the mass, however, are excessively weak to be seen by the unaided eye. The framework is found 2.3 degrees from the boundary of the renowned furrow asterism in the group of stars of Centaurus. Despite the fact that Proxima b is a rough planet, there is still expectation that it could have extraterrestrial life. The quest for some other life out there has carried researchers to Proxima b. They trust the likenesses to Earth's size and its separation from its small star make it a reasonable choice with regards to planets that can oblige life. While every one of these are hypotheses, there's trust there may be some reality. There's a lot to find out about Proxima b and the circle it takes, so remain blocked and find out. You can likewise look at a portion of our other substance connected with extraterrestrials. Do you truly trust there's one more life out there? Leave a remark down underneath. What entrances the vast majority about Proxima b is its closeness to Earth. Concentrates on show that Proxima b is an exoplanet that circles a M-type star. It is thought to be 1.27 times heavier than Earth. In addition, the orbit of Proxima b's star takes 11.5 days to complete. It was found in 2016, and numerous researchers are investigating it. Although Proxima b resembles Earth in appearance, certain characteristics render it inhabitable. For one's purposes, the planet is excessively near its star. In that capacity, it continues to get outrageous bright radiation from the star. It is assessed to be many times more than the radiation we get from the sun. 
The radiation is solid to such an extent that it strips away even the lightest hydrogen atoms after some time and does likewise to oxygen and nitrogen. There is more to Proxima b than meets the eye, despite the majority of people arguing that it should be habitable because it is the same distance from its star as Earth is from the sun distance doesn't consider whether there is water in the world. There is likewise no proof of an environment helpful for living things. The climate on Earth makes it tenable and not Mars. The right air makes it feasible for environment guideline and a water-accommodating surface. It likewise safeguards living creatures from unsafe space climate. If you have been with us thus far but have not yet subscribed, please click the subscribe button. It makes it simple for us to continue to make content like this that you'll adore. Presently, we should see the reason why individuals think the James Webb Telescope will assist us with sorting out whether or not there is life on Proxima b. The James Webb Telescope was sent off in 2018 subsequent to being deferred beginning around 2011. During production, numerous modifications were required to ensure that it provided accurate images. Loeb made sense of that assuming that a planet like Proxima b could ingest light from its star, it could likewise re-emit it as infrared light. The James Webb Telescope was specifically designed for infrared light observation. It can take photographs of this light on the outer layer of a planet and search for designs that could affirm assuming that the planet has water or a climate. Space telescopes are preferred over ground-based ones because they don't have to look through shifting air to see deep into space. This is one of the reasons why space telescopes are preferred over ground-based ones. As a result, they have a better view of what happens outside the solar system than the majority of ground telescopes do. Another benefit is that weather conditions changes on Earth don't influence them, and space experts should rest assured they're getting a reasonable perusing. The main disadvantage to having a space telescope is that fixing it is costly assuming something turns out badly. There have been situations where a little blemish in a space telescope requires an entire mission into space to fix it. Such costs make noticing planets like Proxima be troublesome. With the James Webb Telescope, we have no choice for salvage. It has been sent off over 1.5 million kilometers away, farther than any human has at any point voyaged, so salvage missions are impossible. The James Webb Telescope accompanies a bigger mirror. As a result, we can see all the way back to nearly 13.7 billion years ago, when the universe began. The further away an article is, the further in time we get to see it. The justification behind this is that a chunk of time must pass for light to go from an item back to us. We can now see more distant galaxies in our universe with greater certainty thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope's ability to observe the universe at a longer wavelength in infrared light. Noticing planets like Proxima b has become simpler, and it has pushed the light out of the apparent reach and into the infrared range.